um, dear Tillman and Jim, dear members of the steering committee, dear participants and guests from all over the world, ladies and gentlemen, good morning, guten Morgen, as we say in German. It is my honor and pleasure to welcome you on behalf of Stiftung Mercator to this conference for a dialogue on transformation. I would first of all like to extend the regards of our president, Bernhard Lorenz, who unfortunately cannot be here today. Um, the conference the dialogue comes, at a, comes very timely, comes very timely between two big important events this year, between Rio and June and Doha just ahead. It also comes very timely as the conflict between scarce energy resources and food security, aggravated by climate change, becomes ever more evident. Last but not least, it, it comes timely, as, uh, as Tillman mentioned, Copenhagen in 2009 left many civil society organizations disappointed and disillusioned over their role and possible impact. And it's about time to regain confidence and strength. Civil society, you have a very important role to play in the process of transforming our societies so as to enable them to sustainably live on a non-fossil basis. Climate change, almost needless to say here, is one of the greatest challenges facing humankind. Steps must be taken to prevent dangerous anthropogenic interference with the climate system. This poses a particular challenge in terms of global solidarity and fairness. For Germany, this means maintaining and expanding our international forerunner role as a, in the area of climate protection, but also living up to the responsibility as an industrialized country by setting ourselves particularly high targets for the reduction of greenhouse gas emissions. Stiftung Mercator, as a German private foundation, has therefore put the fight against anthropogenic climate change at the focus of our activities. We are committed to reducing the human cost emissions of greenhouse gas emissions, of greenhouse gases included in the Kyoto Protocol by 40% by 2020, and by minimum 80% by 2050, measured against the 1990 levels. Quite an ambitious target. But of course, we are fully aware that our engagement and our activities can only be seen as a small contribution. An internationally coordinated approach is needed to prevent dangerous anthropogenic uh, interference with this climate system. And Stiftung Mercator is thus both nationally and internationally working on strategies, alliances and projects to develop science-based practical solutions and approaches, concepts towards a low-carbon development path. In our international engagement, we follow the motto of understanding each other, learning from one another, and mastering global challenges together. As a foundation, we try to bring in our strength as a convening power, bringing different stakeholders together to talk to one another. And this is why we are here today. Stiftung Mercator is highly, highly grateful of your dedication and support. I wish you and us all a very successful conference, insightful discussions, growing bonds and promising strategies. And last but not least, I would like to express our deepest gratitude to German Watch and IATP, both teams who have done a really great job in setting this dialogue up. May it last and may it generate the alliances our world so badly needs. Thank you. <laughs>